To find the oxidation numbers for each of the elements in NaOH, sodium hydroxide, we use these rules in a periodic table. So when we look up sodium on the periodic table, it's in group one. And since it's in group one, those elements have a plus one charge. So the oxidation number on the sodium, that'll be plus one. So we go down, we can see that oxygen has a minus two charge, except in a few cases. So the oxidation number on the oxygen, that's a minus two. And then finally, hydrogen, when it's bonded to nonmetals, oxygen is a nonmetal, that has a plus one oxidation number. Since NaOH is a neutral compound, it doesn't have an overall plus or minus charge. In a neutral compound, all the oxidation numbers, they need to add up to zero. So we have plus one and a minus two and a plus one. That adds up to zero, and that makes sense. It follows our rules here. So these are the oxidation numbers for each element in NaOH, sodium hydroxide. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.